Is. I mean, the wind chills are still near zero, if not slightly below, but we're talking a 25 to 30 degree warm up from this time yesterday. Look at this 24 hour temperature change. This is just incredible how much warmer it is. We knew it was coming in with those southwesterly winds, but man, that, just to look at this, that is a, a shock to the system and it will feel much nicer outside despite those wind chills still being near zero. So it's windy. Obviously, it's warmer as I just showed you. Uh, we're still looking for a little bit of light snow tomorrow afternoon, a dusting to maybe a half inch. That's it. This is nothing major that could make the evening commute just a little slippery. Uh, and then a Christmas wintry mix starting off as snow and then could get warm enough during the day that we could see sleet and maybe even rain. So here comes the warmer weather uh, for the next week or so. Uh, the snow right now is up in the UP and the uh, Arrowhead of Minnesota. Just a few flurries making its way through Fond du Lac and Sheboygan counties. These are your temperatures this morning. Not zero, not 10 below like yesterday morning. We're talking teens to around 20 degrees. Now the wind has been 20 to 35 miles per hour and it will stay that way throughout the day today. So very gusty blowing and drifting snow has been an issue at times as well. And the wind chills we're in the single digits above and below zero. The coldest is one below in Whitewater. It was 30 below zero yesterday in Beaver Dam and Watertown, so things are getting better. Still cold, but getting better. And look at this map. This has been so cold for the last two weeks now that Arctic air has finally been pushed back up to the north with the jet stream. Here's your jet stream and temperatures have warmed into the 20s and, and the 30s in southern Canada, pushing that Arctic air where it should be in the Arctic. Goodbye for now. The next seven to ten days look to be mild. Just a few flurries right now in Campbellsport. Fond du Lac is cloudy and 20 degrees. It's 19 in Rosendale, and that wind sustained at 23 and gusting to 30. As I showed you, wind chills close to zero. Look at this afternoon. Sunshine. It's going to be windy, but it's going to be temperatures right at or slightly above the freezing mark. That is going to be a nice change. Sunshine statewide for any travelers. A little bit of cloud cover tonight and then some flurries tomorrow evening uh, as they move on through here. Could see just a dusting of accumulation. Otherwise, no big storms for the rest of the week. Temperatures tomorrow in the lower 30s and less wind, which will be more comfortable as well. And look at this seven day forecast stuck in a nice pattern right around the freezing mark. Uh, and then it does get in, you know, into the 20s overnight. This is a normal forecast with some light snow tomorrow afternoon, just a dusting of accumulation. And then, as I mentioned, could hit 40 on Christmas Day with a rain, sleet, snow mix.